Hey guys, it's Brennan the Paleo Dude, and I'm here with another Jurassic World Mini Action Dino Blind Bag Unboxing. So, I've got four of them here. Um, I got them for four bucks each at, I think it was uh, Sunrise Records. So I live in Canada, so I don't know if that's like a regional place or not, but it's basically this cool shop that sells DVDs, CDs, records, vinyl, stuff like that, t-shirts, posters, like nerdy movie stuff. And uh, they have had some Jurassic World stuff, and I guess they just never sold it, ever. Like, no one would buy Jurassic World stuff from Sunrise, so they just had the same stock for four years now. Um, anyways, so it's a great place to go if you want to get old Jurassic World toys, such as blind bags and human figures. And lucky enough, um, I've been plundering them for these older sets. And uh, it's been great because it's hard to get the, uh, the stegosaurs like this anymore. Um, all the redecos have this weird dark blue <laughs> back and then the tail's unpainted, which kind of sucks. But these ones, you can see there's this kind of whitewash on the body that continues to the tail and it looks very natural. That's what I love. So I, uh, I've been getting a few of them here and there to get the, uh, the stegos, ankylosaurs, stuff like that. Um, you can see this lineup is the one with the Suchomimus and Spino. Um, so yeah, no, I hope I, uh, <laughs> hope I got the right ones. Um, I'm mainly looking for the ankylosaurus and the stegosaurus, um, but I wouldn't mind hunting down more allosaurus. And uh, the Suchomimus is also pretty cool. Uh, the Spino, uh, I don't know, it's not as cool. <laughs> it's it's kind of a little lackluster if you ask me. It, the, it, it has too many fingers, its position is off, it's a little small for my taste. Um, so here we've got the Ankylosaurus in brown. If I move the tail a bit, come on. Maybe not? <laughs> it's a little, uh, little stiff. But yeah, the tail moves side to side. It also rotates, which is kind of cute. And uh, yeah, it's the brown one. I do like the green one a bit more. I wish I would have gotten more of that when it was out. Um, but the brown one's pretty nice. It's pretty cool. Um, this one's pretty heavy. I think it might be another Anki. Uh-oh, cut the paper a bit. It's not good. Oh yeah, it's another Anki. Aww, so cute. Oh yeah, there we go, you can see the tail moves side to side. And I like that they spray the bottom with that, that like lighter beige. It really gives the figure a nice tone to it. I mean, though you can't really see it because it's more low to the ground. <laughs> but uh, yeah, no, that's nice. I think they do it with the Stegosaur too. This one's got three. It's got the, the spray paint color on the bottom, the white brush on the sides, and then this like dark color on the plates. Okay, last bag. Might be a stego. It's kind of uh kind of thin. But still heavy. Yep. And there it is. There's another stego. Kind of sad that the plates on the tail don't have the uh, the continuation of the color but they do have the continuation of the whitewash on the uh, sides to kind of make the highlights stand out a bit more. So that's nice. I like that. Um, so two stegosaurs, two ankylosaurs to add to the, uh, the herds. And there they are. They're so cute. Oh my goodness. I thought I had more of these blind bags. Um, probably somewhere. I'm pretty sure I got more than that, but I'll have to look again and see. <laughs> Everything's a mess right now. I've got so many things to unbox still. Um, but I'll try and truck through that this weekend and post more videos throughout the week. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this little unboxing video, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.